Assume that k is a particular integer. Is negative 17 an odd integer? To answer this question, we have to address the definition of an odd integer. A number n is odd if and only if that number can be written as 2 times some integer k plus 1. So can we write negative 17 as 2 times some integer plus 1? And the answer is yes, we can write negative 17 as 2 times negative 9 plus 1. So in this case, my k is negative 9, and that is some integer. So we can write negative 17 as 2 times some integer k plus 1. So yes, this is an odd integer. Part B, is 0 neither even nor odd? That's a good question. Well, we could write 0 equals 2 times 0, where in this case, k equals 0. And this immediately verifies that 0 is even. Now, can we say that 0 is odd? Well, not quite, because if we multiply 2 times negative 1 plus 1, we get negative 1. And if we do 2 times 0 plus 1, we get positive 1. There's no way we can fit an integer between negative 1 and 0 to make this 2k plus 1 equal to 0. So 0 is not odd. And in fact, there are no odd integers that are also even integers and vice versa. Part C asks, is 2k minus 1 odd? The answer is yes. However, we need to restructure this number 2k minus 1 so that it's 2 times some integer plus 1. It's important to know that these two numbers here are not necessarily the same numbers, even though they're using the same notation for both. What's important with the definition is that you can find some number times 2 plus 1 to get the number that you have. So the question I want you to think about is can we write 2k minus 1 as 2 times some integer plus 1? Well, I can write 2k minus 1 as 2 times k minus 1 plus 1. These two are the same because if you apply the distributive property, this is 2k minus 2 plus 1, which is 2k minus 1. But if you see that when we write it like 2 times some integer plus 1, we can clearly see that this satisfies the definition of an odd number. So yes, this is odd, but in order to justify that this number is odd, we have to explicitly write this expression as 2 times some integer plus 1. And we know that k minus 1 is some integer because we assume that k is a particular integer. So if you take any integer and you subtract 1, you still have an integer. So k minus 1 is an integer. And if we multiply some integer by 2 and add 1, that by definition is an odd integer. Thanks, everyone, and I'll see you in the next video.